Hey guys, it's your inner chakras. Welcome back to the channel, guys. If you are new here, everything you need to know about me on the channel is in the description box. All right, guys, we're starting with the um, major arcana only, just to see what's going on with the energies today. Holy Spirit, holy for the collective, guys, it may or may not resonate. It could just be a message. Right? Holy Spirit, but if you clicked on it, it probably is. So. Someone's world is ending as we speak, right? So something is coming to an end for someone. And they're hopeful for something else. It's like somebody's ending something for their wish fulfillment. They're ending something for what they truly, truly, truly want. All right, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Let's check their... This is Love Psychology 101. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. This person said they need love too. So maybe they told that to the person that they're leaving. They said, I need love too, baby. Holy Spirit. For the collection. Fall all the way out. Fall all the way out. There we go. It says I got you. So this could be a message to you. This person, this could be a message to you. So this person is a bachelor. So whatever they ended, they could have ended a marriage. But they are free now. They are single. Alright, so this bachelor here, guys, wants to talk and have coffee or tea. They want to come and have a conversation with you. <clears throat> Be careful though, guys. Spirit said this this bachelor here has a dark side, right? And they work a lot. So, put two and two together. So there's somebody, a bachelor, who, who who's a new bachelor, right? <clears throat> new bachelor. He's single now, he's free, and you're the one that got away. So now, said bachelor is now reaching out to you, right? And they're going to tell you, I need love too, baby. I got a divorce and this and that. And they're going to come and tell you, they're going to say, I got you. And, you know, they want to come and have coffee and tea. But Spirit said, remember that this one here has a dark side, right? So let's see who this bachelor is. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Who is this bachelor spirit? What is the next one? Who is this bachelor? This bachelor ghosted you guys. They ghosted you. One day you just woke up and then no more phone calls from this person. They ghosted you. Like, they went blank. Holy Spirit. Let's see. What else? Okay. This is a different card. It doesn't go. I'm not going to keep it. <clears throat> Holy Spirit. Ooh. This person is picky. Whoever this bachelor is, they don't like wigs or weaves. <laughs> Alright. Holy Spirit, who is this person? And they also have a fear of abandonment. So they'll leave you. This person will leave you before you can leave them, right? They also been through a lot. They've been through it. This person been through it, but whatever. They finally got out of something. But this guy right here has a dark side. Let's see. They have a hidden pregnancy. So somebody that they left could be pregnant. Uh, they're also addicted to a variety. So they like a little bit of everything, right? They like a little bit of everything. Are coming to you. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Tell us more. That card was flipped over. What's going on, right? This person here. 
They're not making any moves, guys. This person is still up in their head. They still up in their head because they still fight. They could probably still be fighting over that connection there, right? Yeah, they're not making any moves. This person is still up in their head. And they're in their Knight of Swords energy. So they're probably still fighting. Yeah, Five of Swords, I told you. This person is still fighting. They're still fighting with lovers. Something or someone that they're married to. So they may still be married, just separated, right? But they're fighting. Let's read how angels. It's like they're trying to get to this Three of Cups here. But they can't make any moves. They they did end whatever they were in right there. And that's why this this female energy here is the feminine energy is up in her head, like losing sleep and everything. This person plotted and planned this. It's like they've been in hermit for a while. They could have been unhappy for a while. But collective, they did go shoe. See? They didn't put the work in before with you. Edit put the cooking me first. And there was probably no emotional fulfillment for you out of this person. That's because they had someone and then you walked away from them. Five of Pentacles in reverse. So the person that ghosted you or you ghosted them, you probably ghosted each other at the same time. Because you realized that this person was full of shit, right? And there was just, they didn't put nothing in it. Because they were busy. Holy Spirit, what else? Yeah, so this person is going to try to sneak away from what they were in and sneak back to you, Queen of Wands. But you're not going to take what they're offering for a cup's energy. You don't want what they're offering because you know there was a lot of injustice. You found out some things, Collective. You did. You found out some secrets. You're the Queen of Cups. You found out some things. Okay? And you're going to walk away. You're going to stay. Mm -mm. You're going to try to sneak back into your life, but you're not going to take it. What was this? Money problems. This person could be coming back to you collectively because they have money problems as well, right? They could be having money problems. What else? They at the end of the road. It's like uh, they walk on the tightrope. They could be having money problems. Forget marriage. Let's just have fun. See, that's because they just came out of something. This person don't want to get married. That's that bastard energy again, guys. I'm sorry. Will you please give me another chance? So now they're going to beg you for another chance collective. This person could have been sleeping with somebody that they work with. Instead of sleeping with the boss. But this may very well be the end of the work, the end of the road for this person. Because you're gonna find out about these secrets collective. That's what you're gonna do. You're gonna find out about these secrets. And this person here, they may tell you they're not happy with themselves, or even if they don't tell you, know that collective, they're not happy with themselves. The never married bitter woman. Maybe that's how they see you collective. Maybe they think you're maybe they think you're uh, never married. Maybe they think you're bitter. This person lied the whole time, collective. Ooh, they've gotten readings on you. They've got readings on you. Really, collective? I gotta put this over here because I don't want to mix those decks up. There's a few things going on. So, spirit. So they gotta read all the collective. Guys, let's find out. What did they find out about you? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. What did the tell reader tell this person, spirit? We're gonna find out. What did the tell reader tell, tell your person? Because they got readings done on you. Holy Spirit, what did the tarot reader tell this person about the collective? 
What does the tarot reader tell this person about the collective? That you the shit? That you're the emperor? And that they don't they don't want you. Like they don't it's an ending, like it's over with this person here. Like you're in your chair, you moved on. That's what the tell reader said. Y'all don't work well together that you moved on. That you the emperor, you decided that y'all don't work well together and then you moved on. It's the emperor, three of pentacles in reverse, chariot. So that's what they found out. <laughs> Holy Spirit, what else they find out from the tell reader? <laughs> oh gosh. The tell reader told them that they are attached to you like uncannily attached like in the devilish energy and that you know you know about a child page of pentacles in reverse and that you know about their union that they're in you know they're married with children that's what the tarot reader said Tell her to say, you know <laughs> that they're married with kids. Holy Spirit, Holy Angel. What else? The tell reader also told this person that they know that they want you back and they're up in their head about it, but they're hopeful. Mm. Isn't that something? They hopeful for you. They are hopeful for you, collective. Isn't that something? So this person wants you back, collective, because of money problems. Is there anything else we need to see here, Spirit, about this person? Yeah, they could just want you back because of money problems. They probably sat with their boss. Mm. Holy Spirit, what do we have? Yeah, this person, yeah, they're trying to come back. I told you, eight of cups in reverse, three of wands in reverse. They ended something and they're trying to come back to you. And they're going to offer you their cup. They want to do a cup with you. They don't want to fight with you anymore. You're the Queen of Pentacles. Guys, be careful. Don't forget. They're having money problems. Okay? They're having money problems. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Yeah, they're going to be judged for this. This is the sun in reverse. They could have been in court. Oh, they got a divorce. Yep. It's judgment in reverse. Sun, sun in reverse. Four of wands in reverse. This person got a divorce. That's why they're having money problems. And now they're coming to you. Standing in their strength. Because they're like, hey, I can come to you now, right? They figure I can come to you now. And here they come. And the Knight of Wands energy as a page. Because their divorce took all their money. But the only problem I see here is this is a page of cups in reverse. So they're not offering you love. They're not offering you love. They're not offering you love, collective. So... Let this person be. Yeah, they ended their connection. Higher than reverse. They do want this new beginning, but they're not coming in with love. They see you as the nine of pentacles, so. And they're gonna, definitely going to come forward. They're not holding themselves back this time, guys. Just be collective. Just, I mean, just be careful. Holy Spirit. <clears throat> yep, they see you as the ace of pentacles. Ten of cups. They want a family and stuff with you. I guess that's the love there. They're just not telling you all this stuff. King of Swords in reverse. But he's also a narcissist, right? We got a baby's mom here, guys. Holy Spirit, tell me about this Empress in reverse. Holy Spirit, tell me about this Empress in reverse. Yeah, Empress had too many options.
Yeah. They found out Empress was lying. Ace of Swords in reverse. So they left it. So now they want to come and work with you. Queen of Pentacles in reverse. <clears throat> I mean, the Queen of Pentacles upright. Three of Pentacles. They want to come and work with you now. You're the Queen of Swords. They want to do business, business minded. They walked away from that devil. They walked away from their attachment. There's their tower there. They walked away from their past, guys. They're reminiscing about you. They know they caused a lot of deception, though. They also see you as the Ten of Pentacles, the Wheel of Fortune, and here they come in the Nine of Cups. Guys, a lot of this is talking about money. Money, 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 money. I mean, there's love in there, but just be careful, guys. <clears throat> All right, collective. This is your reading. Hmm. I don't know. Thanks for watching, guys. Please like, share, and subscribe. Peace.